As a voice coach, there's never a bad day at the office, but for two of our coaches, the job is especially meaningful. People ask me all the time, what's the greatest thing that has happened for you since you've been on The Voice? I am the king of The Voice! That's a no-brainer, right? I met my fiance here. Did somebody say fashion? It's hard to resist Gwen Stefani. I'll let you have him. Did you really? You did? Yes. No, he didn't. Like, don't you let him manipulate that. <laughs> you know, here's this iconic rock star coming to be a coach on The Voice in a black minivan. That was cool. It's never good when your girlfriend blocks you. <laughs> this brings it to a whole new level. I love it when she's here. She brings a very complicated element of competition for me in particular. But I love that. I love the challenge. Blake's my best friend. If I ever have to tap in for an emergency, She's gonna help me. Ah! Just knowing that she's there and she has my back is pretty cool. Come on. How'd you do that? If you would have told me back in 1996 that Gwen Stefani was gonna be my girlfriend, I would have laughed you out of the room. You get me, you get him. You know what I'm saying? I would have thought you were crazy. What is that? You want a beer? saying it right now. I almost bust out laughing. That's how ridiculous it is. Hold on one second. <laughs> what do you think? I really want her to be <laughs> 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 <laughs>